replacing the rings on the cougar saddle. Disassembling the cougar saddle. Unlatch the velcro on the leg strap or batten seat and unbuckle the strap completely. Remove the slide that's on the quick link buckle. Pull the leg strap through the leg strap connector. Repeat the same procedure with the other leg strap or batten seat. Unbuckle the buckle on the waist back for the rope bridge adjustment strap. Pull the adjustment strap through the side D, through the nylon loop, through the elastic loop, and through the ring on the rope bridge. Repeat the same procedure with the other side of the rope bridge adjustment strap. Remove the rope bridge from the ring on the leg strap and batten seat connector. Loosen the rope bridge loop and slide off over the ring and the connector. Repeat the procedure on the other side. Reassembling the Cougar Saddle Take the new leg strap and batten seat connector with ring and position with the connector up and the ring down. The lap side of the connector should face you. Reattach the rope bridge by sliding the rope bridge loop through the ring and up over the top of the connector. Pull until snug. Repeat the procedure on the other side. Please note, it is important when attaching the rope bridge back to the saddle that the looping parts on each side of the rope bridge are facing outward. Take the rope bridge adjustment strap and run it back through the ring. Through the elastic strap. Through the nylon strap. Through the side D and through the buckle on the waist back. Repeat the procedure on the other side. Run the leg strap or batten seat through the leg strap or batten seat connectors. Through the slide that was removed on the leg strap buckles or batten seat buckles. And attach to the Velcro. Repeat the procedure on the other side.
make sure the elastic straps on the leg straps or batten seat are towards the saddle back and the buckle is on the outside. 